Welcome to Simple Logical. This is Vinkesh. Here is an interesting math problem which is confusing and requires deep analysis before arriving into the correct answer. Or uh, this is some kind of expression which is provided and we are supposed to find the answer after thorough analysis. Feel free to pause the video and give a try before checking the solution. Once done, continue watching the video to know the right answer. Let me explain the solution now. There is some ambiguity in the way this expression is written, so it can be interpreted in different ways, which can lead to different answers. However, the most common interpretation is: in this math expression, the tricks are that the lines ending with two don't have a plus sign next to them, which means they should be combined with the following line. the expression all on one line can be written like this let's now solve this expression according to bodmas rule multiplication to be performed first just for your information bodmas is a short form for brackets of division multiplication addition and subtraction this is the order in which mathematical operations to be performed now let's get back to the problem after performing multiplication according to both mass rule expression will be like this now perform addition operation which will result in 572 which is a correct answer so by following these simple steps we can find the answer to these kind of problems in lesser time and accurately Which number is larger here? Three to the power of seventy-five or two to the power of hundred? Feel free to pause the video and give a try before checking the solution. Once done, continue watching the video to know how to solve this problem with minimum number of steps. Let me explain the solution now. To begin our exploration, let's first simplify these expressions for a clearer comparison. We can express three power seventy-five as three power three times twenty-five. And two power hundred as two power four times twenty five. This step highlights the common factor of twenty five in both exponents, setting the stage for a more straightforward comparison. Continuing our journey into simplification, we transform three power three times twenty five into twenty seven power twenty five and two power four times twenty five into sixteen power twenty five. Now, with the exponents equal at twenty-five for both bases, we are ready to make an informed comparison. So, what do we find? Twenty-seven part twenty-five is indeed greater than sixteen part twenty-five. It's essential to recognize that twenty-seven, that is three part three, is larger than sixteen, that is two part four, and when raised to the power of twenty-five, this disparity becomes even more pronounced. Therefore, the answer to our initial question is that. 27 power 25 is the larger number thus 3 power 75 is greater than 2 power 100 by following these simple steps we can solve these kind of problems in less than 10 seconds the solve for this video thanks for watching let's meet in the next video with one more interesting mathematical problem thank you